Abby. We got Chanel. Soften up the mess. Drop it in the water. Let the daughter find an image with the rest. She'll be learning how to breathe. Spinning through our dinner. Hello, guys. Welcome to a new vlog. So it is Friday the 30th. No, Saturday the 30th um of December and we are like two days away from the new year today is gonna to be like jam-packed day because I gotta go I'm going to pick up one of my friends now we're gonna to go to brunch then we're gonna pick up my friend Jen from the airport then I have work later so my kit is in the back there packed up looking all good and I just went inside and I changed my jacket cuz it's a little chilly today I had on a nice little soft cardigan kind of vibe thing but I was like I'm not gonna be cold today so that's why I have on this big puffer jacket with no shame to uh, yeah I just have it on this is what I'm wearing <laughs> this is what I'm wearing uh, so yeah let's let's go I, I need to get gas what's new I put some more powder on my face because my face is looking so dark so I put some more powder on it to kind of balance it out and this is where I'm literally still feeling out I'm literally still feeling out this angle I didn't have on this jacket I had on a green jacket a very small one but then I came outside and I was like mm -mm. I prefer wearing the big one because <laughs> I want to be cold at all today so I'm getting gas and then we're gonna pick up Abby let me get her dressed in go we sold it for the brunch I had on my nice on jacket we are so late. <laughs> we are at brunch. We have Abby. Say hi to the vlog. <laughs> we need to take a picture of this because the light is coming in this way. I'm going to take a picture of us. So yeah, we're at this place called the Grand. But I have to pick up Janae just now. So it's kind of like really interesting. Let's take a photo this way. I wonder if I would need more food. Oh, you look so nice. You look beautiful. Oh. Wow. So. Oh my God, is this we got all the girls here. We got Abby. We got Janelle. <laughs> okay, yeah. me and the girls here. We got Abby Floyd. This is so pretty. <laughs> for her birthday. Her birthday was like two days ago, but we oh Jenny looks so nice. I love the I love the suit. Yeah, this is a crux. <laughs> you all can't see it, but I love the little crux. This is the crux skill. I love it. It looks good though. So yeah, we have fixed the satin. Yeah, yeah the nice. satin is nice. No, it looks really nice. Yeah. yeah. Very, clean yeah. Mm -hmm. Very clean. I changed the satin, so that's kind of better. Mm -hmm. But yeah. 18 months and some stuff. Shopping for the babies, Abby's babies. <laughs> well, one baby and one toddler. That child is big. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh, nice. Nice. I do this to smell the cream and it come up in my nose. Why did I have one? Oh my god! Like it popped up in my nose. Here, try to look cute. Like why did that happen? Oh my god. No, it does, huh? Oh my god. No. Hey guys. Hi. Hi. <coughs> I have a little cough. I have a little cough. It's so Jenny annoying. have a little cough. I just oh bought gosh. a new jacket. Well, yeah, I show you guys I bought a new jacket. Abigail, let's go, but we're going to pass back by her later. Yeah. And um, because she having like a little. Oh, 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 oh. She having. I'm going to pass you guys to Jen. Yeah. Let yes. Hold this. Okay, good. Having, Abigail having a little thing at our house tomorrow so what no, later today, this later <laughs> so <coughs> we will, you know we'll pass up there and just hit a little line but and i have hi. two clients right now so i'm going to go to the rest come back say <laughs> hi tomorrow is what sunday tomorrow is sunday no tomorrow is yes tomorrow, tomorrow is sunday, sunday. because so, tomorrow is all yes. right yes. on exit 1w so we're going to um see what we can do tomorrow Okay, bye. Even if we're tired, we're still making a truly rest of the day. Maybe, yeah, maybe Jenna needs to sleep for two days and then we can get back to business. <laughs> no, but we'll be fine. We pump it. We two pump days. It. And I just pump it right now. <laughs> Jenna, have a call for all guys. We can, forgive we can me, forgive me. Feet. Keep I 
I am finally home and as you see I lost my mic for my camera today and I'm trying not to make it a big deal but yes now I'm gonna show off it is a mess if you guys can even hear me with on a mic but I'm gonna work on getting a new one I'm gonna look for one online tomorrow or it's on Amazon and just keep the show going I just took off my makeup so now it's the time to take a bath and yeah good night I'll see you guys tomorrow I just look back at them vlogs and say you're here hard to be like it's on the internet to be there forever no like uh, these are oh, this, this, this is on youtube i watch my hair in the christmas vlog and i say god forbid how i could just be walking around my head so it's true this is this is a nice sweater yeah um i say well how are you gonna be walking around with your hair like so mm -mm, it's easy but good morning yeah jenna and i finding close for church later finding close for church later um, yes, because I mean, it's the last day of the year, so <coughs> but I don't know. I just show some myself out. Do I not have a short dress somewhere? I don't know. I need some more boots. If there's one thing I need, is one some more boots. I also try to tie me here with these now instead of regular boogies. Use them I don't know why what's the purpose of these but I'm trying to use these instead of regular with these and um, as I told you guys let me pull up my camera my camera I lost the the muffler for the mic right it's not really mic the mic is in the camera itself oh. but the muffler right, for the sound. sound okay but I say I was telling the Lord I said God I'm so disappointed in myself I should have paid more attention you know oh. But then I say, I pray about it. I say, all things will take a for him. Then I just get this thought. Go online and find one. So I went and buy a whole set of camera accessories. I buy a new okay. lens. I buy the muffler. Buy I buy a light last night. I spent like $100 on when camera accessories. Sleeping? Yeah, last night. They say you mustn't shop any night. You know, your brain don't look good. Um, so yeah, so that should, come, <laughs> that should come tomorrow. So we will have some new angles. And all shall be well in Jesus' name. Gentle to the vlog. Hello, hello, it's the <laughs> Hello, hello, it's the last year last of twenty twenty three. Yeah, last day of the year. Mm -hmm. So we hope that you are also or you did or you can relate to something while you're watching this, what you did that same morning. <laughs> I'm about to brew my coffee. I use this there's 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 a name for this enough. A French press and I have this from Duncan that I bought the holiday blend from Duncan because Jen and I I did Jen's makeup she looks amazing come over here mm -hmm. she looks mm -hmm. amazing and mm -hmm. I am have to do my thing but I want some coffee and some cricks before I get started to boost up your energy my energy is a bit my tantalo is about to be embarking on us and I feel like Praise God for deliverance. I feel like my body is trying to get used to getting a real period. Whoa. So I think I ovulated for the last couple of days. Because mm. even when I put in my cup, I see the white, thick, that white, yeah. thick mucus. Yeah. So I feel like my body, like because I had irregular periods for so long, my body is now trying to get used to ovulating again. Yeah, so my body is shock yeah. now too mm. because it's like, oh, what is happening? Well, you know, this one may come a bit. This one may come with a vengeance, but going with a God. Ugh. I can understand. You're a perfect man. Got the whole world in your hands, but you're still reaching out for me. Ooh, wow. Why you love me too? I'm nothing like you. Opposite of holiness was what I was, but I'm till you. See my soul at
This is one of my best cup of coffees yet. Mm, it is so good. I think the holiday, um, and I didn't put any sugar. So that's really good. I just use the oat milk, the um, vanilla syrup, and the holiday blend coffee and no sugar. Seems like a deal to me. Let me go get ready. I look a mess. <laughs> Jen and I are going to church for New Year's. This is my little outfit. Boots, skirt, top. Yada yada yada. Alright, so this is my face beat. Isn't it so pretty? I use this top from Jen. I'm a little hair piece in the back there. Need moisturizer though. Needs moisturizer. Alright, I'm gonna put on your lips. So Jenna and I am at church. Ready for the service to start. We went to dinner first. Though. Dinner was nice. I'm gonna put in some clips here, but we're gonna see some clips from the church service. I know a cute little outfit. Catch the round of applause. What's your name? Taryn. Hey, Taryn. I just, I just dare you to leave your voice in 2023. Your legs hurt tomorrow because you've been dancing and shouting. And giving God praise. Amen. Who came to give God praise on this last yeah. night? I need a shout in this place. Let's go. Okay, guys, it is 39 minutes till the new year. 39 minutes. 34. Listen. Second. I'm going to talk to all the counties. Why nice. all you nice days? But it will give you every day. But it's up to you to do something with it. Come on, let's go. I'm answering this question today's the first of December first of January I was working I have one more client I'm just relaxing in the car before I do her then I'm gonna go home but um somebody asked in not last week's vlog the week before they asked how do you do devotions and what does it consist of because they're saying that the Bible could sometimes be hard for them to understand which is like very understandable so i'm going to explain to you guys what i do basically my devotions consist of journaling about my day about like uh, like about my experiences about what it is i need the help of the lord with so it's kind of like lord i realized that i was quick to anger today help me with that you know also thank him for the day so i would just kind of journal and like talk to him thank him for the day some people instead of journaling they prefer to kneel down and do that part and they prefer to you know do it in different ways but i love journaling then i may listen to a worship song and then i may google a scripture like you know scriptures and anger like whatever i'm experiencing i may google a scripture or a bible book on that and read that based on what i'm going through so i would read the bible based on what i'm going through and then um so then i would kind of go to that scripture read it dissect it google what does this mean in that book and that's kind of how I'll do devotionals, right? And then sometimes I may just want to start to read a chapter. So I started reading like Luke the other day. And then Luke is the end of the, the um, three Gospels. Like the um, Gospels of um, Matthew, Mark, Luke and John. So John is the... Yes, I was reading John. John is the last one. So then I sat over and I went to Matthew. And every night I would read or listen to a chapter. So I listened to the chapter and see what stood out to me from the verses and meditate on it and then journal about that and how I could see that in my life. So my devotions really consist of 
reading the scripture, meditating on it, maybe listening to worship music and journaling to God. And sometimes I would just sit and I would just listen, you know? So in the morning, it may be that I read a scripture and I'll take that scripture with me in the day. And in the night, I will just debunk it and say, God, thank you for the day, but, um, you know, I think that this is true. And, you know, just it's just like a conversation, like a relationship. So sometimes reading the scripture is not about all about understanding this big grand thing, but allowing one little verse, one little line, two lines to speak to your heart and allowing God to use those two lines to speak to you. You know, so I, you know, I believe like when you're now getting into learning the word and doing devotions and having that sick and that sacred time to God, don't try to bite off more than you can chew. Take a verse, a verse or two and meditate on that daily. And then once you stay consistent, you're going to grow. And also I found that it's important to pray against spiritual laziness and ask God to continuously give you the desire to seek his word. Because I used to like do devotion sometimes and then not do it. But then I realized that, um, you know, it's like, it's beneficial to us if we do devotion and, you know, just have that time with God every day. I realized that I feel like part of the plan of the enemy is for him to frustrate us enough that we don't go to the world and we just so tired with everything. So in order for that not to happen, you ask God to continue to put the desire in your heart for his word and for his, and for the things of God, you know? So let your prayer be, God help me to desire to go into your word, to seek your word. And every time you start to feel the desire dropping, pray about it again. So that has kept me really consistent with having devotional time with God. I hope this was very helpful. Good morning, guys. This is my gym outfit for today. Gen gym shoe. This is my gym outfit for today. Isn't it so cute? You get to see how my I'm losing. This is a large. I'm going to order more, but in medium so that it'll be more fitted. This is a large do. And can't say I hate the large. Camera. My mic and stuff for the camera ain't coming yet. Coming in tomorrow, which is Wednesday. But Jenna and I are going to the gym right now. Then gonna do a little errands and then we're gonna get back home. So let's do it. Looking at myself in the mirror. <laughs> Because if I don't, who went? Hey guys, I'm home from the gym. I'm about to make my after workout smoothie because I already know um, when you're working out, you have to have your protein a certain amount of time after you work out. Like you can't wait too long to, to, um, to like get some protein in. So, that's just a handful of berries. Maybe just like so. Maybe just like so. And I'm gonna get some bananas. You guys know I prepped my bananas. I prepped it this morning, like 5 a.m. I prepped my bananas. I should have put my camera on, but I didn't. Is that fridge towing out or something? Why is it so so? Hmm. It all do. I'm gonna be on a low setting. Then what I do too is I. some bread and egg too so I think I'm gonna make that let's do it Tell the truth. 
Mm -hmm. Throwing away my old way, something that okay, I gotta guys. do. Let's go. I wash my hair and I leave it out. So I'm gonna wait for it to dry and then I'm gonna comb it out into like a fro. So let's go, let's go, let's go. I have an apple. I bought a Christmas sweater because this year, this Christmas or last Christmas, Christmas two weeks ago, I had no sweater, no obvious sweater for any event. So I got one on sale. I got it on sale for nine dollars on H and M. So let's open it and see. <laughs> I look so wild. Look at my hair, so wacky. Anyway, this is my sweater for next year Christmas. It's Max seasonally stuffed, and it has this nice little mesh fluffy thing on it and it was ten dollars i bought a large because i don't want it to be too close i just want it to be like falling on me like so so from big clothes going but yeah i think it's so cute maybe i should have gotten a medium because when it washed me you know get stretchy but anyway maybe i should looks good to me yeah i love it I also bought this. Why is this sweater so disappointing? It looks like a 90. I bought a medium and it's so big. Maybe I needed a um, small. Am I losing weight? These like diamante things on it. See? But why is this? Like this is to the side of it. Like why is that there? Is that supposed to be there? Like, I'm confused. I don't like it. You understand me? Walk her down the valley, pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet. Teach her how to jump and how to stretch. Hello, hello, hello. Good morning. Well, good evening. I went to the gym today. Oh, I went to the gym today. And it's now 3 p.m. I got back home, but Janae, we're gonna cook some macaroni and spaghetti. No, what? We're gonna cook minced meat and spaghetti. We have the ragu sauce. I just have to pick up like a couple of things in the store for for this trip. But um, I just wanted to say hello. I came for me dream. I made my smoothie. I was on um a call with my friend for like a long time, so and I just feel a little tired, but God is so good. Oh. God is so good. What I wanted to tell you guys, Jen is calling me. I wanted to tell you guys the the stuff came for the camera from Amazon today. The stuff came for the camera, so we're gonna like up, upgrade the camera. I need to make a TikTok video upgrading the camera. I need to make two YouTube videos for today for um, for my girls on the Beauty Biz Mental and also on the um the makeup artist mentorship page on tiktok and instagram so yeah i have all of that to do so when we go back home we're gonna do a tiktok like dressing up the camera now you know gonna do a little voiceover saying i've had this sunny cv one for like about two and a half years now and i lost my mic and I just reordered one and I decided to reorder everything that I need to get this baby up to par. So let's go. Hello guys. Hello. We are going to see the lights. It's gross. Yes, now. yes. And I mean, when could you see the lights when it's dark? Because the lights is more light in then. <laughs> <coughs> We're going to pick up Abby now. I'm yeah, but be... I'll be right back. Because my, would we be home before 10? Before. I'll have to take my next tablets. Uh, you want to bring it in case? We, we should be, but... It's seven, seven to eight, eight to nine, nine to ten. But well, what will we be doing now? Yeah. Okay, fine. <laughs> we'll be back. I mean, we, we found a miracle worker, what? so we want to keep it close. Yes, we got something for Jen's cough, which is like really super duper good. So yes. we want to 
keep that going. Oh wow, I feel so warm. Thank God. Yeah, I feel yeah. warm and nice, nice and yeah. toasty. I'm glad I made it. I wasn't going to be there. Mm -hmm. I said I'm a bean, so I would feel nice, you know? I think that's why the layers are important. Yeah. yeah. God keep us and guide us as we go. Amen. Yeah, our steps in Jesus' name may be a good fast. time, a great time, a your time. Yeah. Amen. 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 <laughs> okay, guys, so I'm going to put in some um b-roll of the lights but we have to get abby i feel like every time i'm out with my girls i'm like we should like do something like besides what we are doing right do you know? spontaneous. <laughs> like well, you like, all stay tuned because we're gonna do something and yeah. take it as motion yeah i'm like we should like get hot chocolate or ice cream or cake oh there's this cake please i'm gonna check the cake too. Let ice cream in the ice. Ah. yeah no there's this cake please guys it's epic you should have really get tablets because we might be out <laughs> No wait, you're not going back. What do you think? Um, um, let's be right back. <laughs> with Lord okay, Jesus, okay. we declare in this neighborhood in my life. Cheers. To the good life only. Because we are children of God, we don't deserve less. No limits, you know. This is not the Nutcracker House, but this is close. Yeah, it's very, it's very bright. Sasa, do you like? Pretty. Take a picture by Joy. Take a picture by Joy. Let me take a picture for you. Nice. Good. It is snowy. You need to get some snow like that. I wonder if this also has got a good tax discount because of all the publicity, the lights. I don't know. I'm like, this could be a good write off. Next time this writing of the whole bill for the year. Janelle needs to urinate. We are oh this, this is looking bad. Yeah. <laughs> How are we feeling girls? We are at the ice cream place. Cold. Yeah, it's so pretty. I love this bakery. It's my favorite bakery. Bring the girls out to see it. Oh walk is so fun. So cute. So much. You all know I be getting shocked from the dolls all the time, all the time. Brought the girls to my favorite place. Oh, sorry, Jen, but Jen thing is looking so good. <gasps> Baby, you'll have these things here. Have you have this pumpkin pie, coffee? I have red velvet tea. Been the most. This is like the most pretty gingerbread house I've ever seen. And it's so pretty. Like, could you touch it? Oh my god, somebody actually built it. Oh my god, it's so nice. It's so pretty. Oh my god, I love it. Army yelling from the roof. I touch, put up a garden. Count to ten. Lions den, speaking with the higher pen. Can't be touched by fire. Then. Fast forward to the grown things now. I'm working on them soul things now Forgiving all your old ways But it's harder on the cold day Hey guys, we are here Jen here I am here We are watching Better Kit Together with Christian Girls What else should we do? I'm editing the vlog This is the video has me We shall be doing something about it um, it's a good day. I'm gonna check in with you guys, but I have something better to say. <laughs> nice. So Tequila's gonna make this coffee today. <laughs> I'm so excited to taste this Tequila special. What are you gonna name it? Um, you should name it. Maybe like the Tequila specialty coffee, I guess. Mm -hmm. Like when you go to the coffee shop, say, "Could I have a Tequila latte, please?" Oh yeah. Yes. Oh, nice. Hi, can I have the tequila? What type of milk? Oh, almond caramel. <laughs> Girl. Tequila or regular almond caramel? Oh, almond caramel. I know. So we're going to get Jen some coffee. So this is what I do. Nice. I just wet it. But I showed them any last yesterday. I showed them any vlog too. So yeah, they can not really. I just put in a little water so that it can. This is a French press, guys. I put in a little water because you want to make sure the coffee, like, you know, like it coming really good now. Mm hmm I mean you really good you gotta make sure. So I'm just putting that water there. Press I think it in Donuts should you know? Sponsor. Sponsor. Oh, yeah. Yes, in stuff, Jesus' yeah. name. Come on, Duncan. Product placement. Product placement. Oh my god. It's splashing my face. 
but you have to grind it down so that it will mix nice now. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna like sit for like three minutes. There's a timer. Okay, and it's simple. Simple. You just brewing your own coffee, basically. This is me and Jen, so. So your timing. I try to get the timer to start. To start over. So you have the MLMs. What do I have here? Hot cocoa served here. This is the cream oil. Hello guys. I put on makeup to do videos online and I'm now home. So I put on makeup to do videos. So Jen and I was inside all day. As I showed you guys. I that I went to get ready. I've been so tired and so like my body trying to play catch up. So I sat back my birth control today because I find when I take any birth control, my body has have more energy and it's like when it is your hormones of balance, right? It does affect your energy and your body. So I say I have to take it back. I just have to take it because I can't operate on this low energy. Like I really can't. Like I need the energy to do my work, to do my posting, and I had two extra packs of birth control and I'm like, God, let me start this birth control because when I said I didn't have energy to do anything, I mean anything, I tired, hold it. I was tired from the time I wake up to the time I went and sleep, you know, that can be it. So I also want to study Bible. I have the camera on it right now. I want to study Bible at a Bible study that I went to last week. And the girl brought it for me at the gym, and it's a very big Bible. Let me show you. <laughs> I just had the camera on it. This is the Bible. It is a life application study Bible, to the edition. Large print. It is so good. Like I needed this study Bible because the Bible I have is more like a woman study Bible, just like a girly, you know, pretty thing. And I don't really read the devotionals in it anymore, so I kind of needed a study Bible. And I want to kind of just go through it and show you guys how the inside is. I'm so excited to do devotions tonight or tomorrow with this Bible. I have to take off my makeup, go take a shower. I ate food and I had a protein shake and I think I had them too close together. Then I started to feel sick. I tried to go to the gym. I was hitting two ups. Yeah, so sorry if you guys um, are not hearing me, but um... So yeah, the, um, since I changed the camera settings, so you guys see how good this lighting is. Yeah, so I want this Bible. Let me show you guys inside of it. I was just saying I have to take off my makeup and go bead, stuff like that. So that's what I still have to do. Cute, but I need the energy. I need the energy. This can be my life, oh. This cannot be it. Right, so. My client just sent me a video saying, this is how you look with your Stanley. Anyway, let me show you all the Bible. I'm tired, guys. I'm tired. I'm just trying to go through my days without complaining. I'm rocking these green nails. This is how big it is. This is my face. This is how big it is. This is like a grandfather Bible. I feel like new level unlocked. I feel like God is like, time to upgrade get into the meat of the wood somewhere. I feel so blessed. I feel like this was a gift from Jesus. I know it's just a Bible, but you know, it, it's like a big girl Bible. So I feel so good. Cause you know, I'm, a, I'm um, reading Matthew now. So I was just going through Matthew to see like the different stuff. So let me show you guys. Okay, it's like, you see Genesis, Excellence, Pentecost is one. Then it's like three and one they put. But then the pastor put a nice little note. He said, he said two sister to Kida Pastor Michaelson season of elevation I receive in Jesus name and then it says sister to Kida over your life I declare Isaiah 54 17 no weapon formed against you shall prosper and every tongue which rises against you in judgment you shall condemn in the name of Jesus. I condemn every tongue right now. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord and their righteousness is from me, says the Lord. Amen. This is so nice. And then I can put like my family tree here. 
right so what i wanted to show you guys is like um so when you go to like match it right i didn't match it all right so when you go so like they have all of this stuff here we did tell it like this is how it looks and then they have all of the so yeah like you could study and learn about all of this stuff you need to learn so this is not a bible to take to church but it's more like a bible to have home to just study all right so i like how they tell you the statistics of the purpose of the book of matthew right then it have the author the um original audience the choose when it was written um who matthew was he's a jewish collector um, tax collector the key people in the book the places that was written in and the special features which I will love the timeline it would have been how the great king begins to rule and then it have the blueprint the birth and preparation of Jesus I like that then here we have I like how the Ex, like they explain in the theme of the book, right? They explain in the theme Jesus is King, the Messiah, the Kingdom of God. Teaches. So I love that they show you the key places in Matthew, so you can go through the map and see these are the key places in Matthew that we have to pay attention to. That is the study Bible. I'm just gonna keep it in here because, as Janice said, I need to get a case for it. I feel like God is like a calling it to go higher. This is what this Bible means to me. I'm so happy. <sighs> um, yeah, so I'm gonna take off my makeup now and I'm going to oh, uh, I'm gonna sleep. I'll talk to you beautiful people tomorrow. Honey, my hair's a mess. I'm going to the gym again because since yesterday. I went to the gym but I was playing. This is very serious, so I'm gonna go back and do some ab workouts. I'm gonna carry my mat and do some weights, some ab workouts. And do I feel to go? No. Am I gonna go? Yes. <laughs> I also have an appointment at the bank. Lips are dry. So that's kinda like good. It's gonna put my hair in a little ponytail you guys might order that mic sense sunday still didn't come so but what is this still not here the mic muffler so that's not good i remember this one time right i didn't know to comb my hair yet and my mommy didn't comb my hair when I was in primary school, kill my aunt, put my hair in some tutu plaits. I could have been about standard form. I cry, I cry. I, I, I went to school about nine o'clock that morning. I cry. I said, but how my mother could not comb my hair. Girl, I learned to comb my hair after that. It was so bad. That's like a trauma memory for me. Like, it was so sad. Them two to plat skill. Oh lord, I went to school. I was no gel, nothing. I just, just you know, some you know, some big plats. Cause my mother she used to comb my hair in good caterers. Yeah. I like she didn't comb my hair, and I wasn't going to school because she didn't comb my hair. So my aunt, she was like, no way, you're going to school. She put my hair in some big plat skill. I was so ashamed to go to school with my hair like that. But I lived. Do I remember that memory? Yes. Would I do that to my kids? I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. I would probably teach them to comb their hair from younger. I'll just do braids or something. But my mom, she used to give us some nice cornrows. That used to be nice. Guys, the car mount is up. How do we like it? I think we like it. Let me show you all in this view of things. This is the car mounts. I think I like it. So let's drive and talk to see how it works. 
If, okay guys, this is the mount when I'm driving. I think that it's a bit shaky, but I don't know if that's something that could be helped. I don't know if like the shakiness is something that could be helped or if this is just like what we have to work with. I like the angle that we got because I can turn it around in case I have somebody else. But let me know if it's too shaky because I see the camera shaking right now. How is the volume? Well, the mic hasn't come in yet, so we don't know. I'm gonna use this as my, so like press play and stuff, but I need to go home and charge it. So we're off to the gym right now, and I'm so glad we can have our car conversation in peace. <gasps> oh my God, let me get a snap for TikTok and, cause I'm doing a TikTok video right now. I'm so excited we can have our talks, like all about the, what is God doing right now? You know, I love to talk to you guys about what God is doing. But anyway, what he's doing is I realized that a lot of us, you know, I feel like, I feel like God was teaching me that a lot of us, we have to, um, right, we have to increase our faith and increase our knowledge of him and just get to know him some more before he really shows us what he wants to do in our lives or before he even starts to do what he wants to do in our life because I feel like what he was telling me was that um like he wants to give us so much good things and do so much good things for us but our faith is not yet there at the level that it needs to be to receive or even to believe to receive because some of the things that God wants to do for your life is only faith will bring it to pass but if you don't know him enough and if you don't spend enough time with him and if you don't believe his word and if you have doubt in your heart and doubt in your mind disillusion and discouragement it's going to be hard for you to receive and it's going to cause a lot of delay in your life so i feel like over the last couple of days that's what the lord has been speaking to me about just increasing my faith and increasing my knowledge of his goodness so i've been listening to testimonies on youtube just testimonies listen to testimonies to build your faith because the word of god says that what he did for somebody else that he will do for you he's not a respecter of his sons he's not a two-faced god that means he will do something else for somebody else and he wouldn't do it for you so know that what not like you're going out here wanting what other people have but just in case you desire something that is similar to what somebody else has have. Don't feel like God won't do it for you. You understand? Don't feel like because this person get married and you want to get married. It wouldn't happen. No, God is not a respecter of persons. What he did for somebody else, he will do for you. But where is your faith? And that's the lesson God has been teaching me. Increase your faith. Increase your knowledge of my goodness and my mercy and my love. <sighs> God is good. So yeah, I'm off to the gym now. And I'm gonna do yoga today. Not yoga, what? I don't even do yoga. I'm gonna do abs today. But because I'm carrying my mat, like one of those yoga mats, because I'm carrying the mat, um, that's why I'm like, I'm gonna do yoga. I don't do yoga. I'm gonna do abs today at the gym. So that should be fun. Okay, bye. Day three and a half at the gym, because yesterday I came, but I didn't do much. This was mostly for Janae to do something. So I did just, just a small something, but honey, it's just about showing up, huh? So, let's go. Let's go. I got an appointment at the bank that I'm late for. <laughs> hello. Hello, hello, hello. <sighs> hello, guys. So, I'm just done reading this book, The Power of Positive Thinking by Norman Binspiel. This book was so good that I, when I finished reading it, I was like, Lord, bless this man. I prayed because it was like my brain... My mind came out of a jail cell. This book is so good. It's a book that I would never give away. I would keep and I would continue to go back to the highlighted pages when necessary. So get this book. It's sold locally in Trinidad. I think my aunt got it at RJK. RJK Services Limited. That is... It's not Ishmael and Khan, but the um, other bookstore, RJK something. And so now I'm on to a new book, drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. I'm on to a new book, Miles Monroe, The Power no, the purpose and power of love and marriage. So I was looking at a YouTube video about how a couple met and just like the ups and downs in marriage. 
and they quoted so many passages from this book and they say it was so instrumental in their dating in their engagement and in their marriage so i was like you know i'm about to stay ready so i don't have to get ready so i believe like this is my season that god is preparing me you know having me pray for my husband more read books kind of like stay ready so i have to get ready i'm so excited to read this book though you know i became way more intentional about praying for my husband and, my, and not just my husband like my marriage because i feel like i feel like i get to the point where i realize that marriage is a kingdom thing and not just about the man like i feel like it's about the kingdom and about the marriage and the unity of the marriage instead of just like the two people so you know yeah I hope this book is a blessing. I'll keep you guys updated as to what I'm learning. It's on Amazon for $21, I think. Goodbye. So goodbye. And it's by Miles Monroe. So that's always good. Let me go get a matches or oh, um I wanna light that candle, so I'm gonna get a right to outside. What's good for me, cause you're good for me Everything I am, I'm trading God's been revealing this revelation, I had to upgrade the title It's gonna be trading faith It's gonna take you trading where you put your faith And what we have to do, which is a very scary thing for people Is take our trust out of what's gotten us here And now put it, trade it For the presence of what God wants to do in our life Trading faith it's changing the faith that got you here for the faith that will take you there. Where's there? Your prophetic promise? Where is there? You walking in purpose? When my anger's about to go crazy, I don't run to a bottle. That's what I used to trust. That's what got me here. I don't run to money and being a workaholic. That's what I used to trust. That's where I used to put my faith. I don't even run to my husband or wife because they are not the source. They are just a resource. I am trading where I used to go and I'm putting it in the one who can actually heal me. 